Bienvenue, mon nom c'est Nicole Saizenou et qui est Nicolas Evna et je suis là pour vous présenter Mr. Dr. Injekri. Did you just call me Mr? I... Did you know the last time I was called Mr? I... 20 years ago. I'm That's Dr. I... Njakere Damages. Dr. Njakere Damages. Damages. You <laughs> Welcome to the show. My name is Dr. Damages. You're coming to you from the greatest city in the world. New York City! Yes, yes, yes. New York City is so great. Yeah. But it's in Chicago and Abuja uh -huh. that the big stories of the week happen. Hey. You see, last weekend alone, uh -huh. 66 people were shot in the city of Chicago. Wow! 66 and two of them died. Wow. But it didn't make the front page of newspapers in America. No, no, it's normal, normal life. You know, did President Trump tweet about it? No. no. He was busy taking issues with LeBron James, uh -huh. who went on CNN show, Don Lennon show. You know the name of Don, Don yeah, 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 Lennon show, yeah, yeah. Lemon show, to complain about Trump's divide and rule style of government. Oh. Take a look. You know, we, we we are in a position right now in America, more importantly, where this whole this race thing is is, is taking over. You know, and, and um, because, one, because I believe our president is kind of trying to divide us. Ah, the king. I know, I know. He the said, king. he said it. He said, no, no, no. Here is Trump's reaction. Look at the tweet. LeBron James was just interviewed by the dumbest man on television. Wow. Don Lemon. <laughs> he made LeBron look smart, which isn't easy to do. I like Mike. Uh, <laughs> That's classic Trump, you know. Uh, uh, don't, don't, don't you love Trump? Yeah. You know? I know I know you do. I see ton of things you guys write on social media. I know you, 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 you. I see you. I see when you type those things. <laughs> I know. You guys love Trump. Trump's decision to attack LeBron James uh, was masterstroke. Yeah. Especially coming days after LeBron James opened his I Promise school. Did you see this school? Yes. 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 For kids at risk kids at his hometown in Ohio. Take a oh. look. Take a look at it. This oh. Oh. Did, did Michael oh. Jordan do something like this? <laughs> Without his money. You know, nothing. Anyway, here is how Bishop Talbot Swan. Do you know the guy? No. You know the guy? No. Bishop, yeah. How he reacted to Donald Trump's attack on LeBron James. Take a look at it. Ah. He said, LeBron James married his high school sweethearts. Uh -huh. He has three children by one woman. Uh -huh. Unlike the video and whiskey. Uh -huh. <laughs> he has more morality in his pinky toe uh -huh. than ten of you. Mm -hmm. LeBron builds schools for children. Uh -huh. He doesn't lock them in cages. Oh. Keep his name out of your mouth. Mm -hmm. You know life gas lighting dresses scum. I said, damn, I wanted to wash my mouth after that. <laughs> and the man is a bishop. Imagine what he would have said if he isn't a man of God. You know? Can you, can you say something like that about your president? Can you say something like that about your president? Now, for those who care but do not know, and for those who know but do not care, Donald Trump has not met any black person that is not dumb. None. Or there is no pay. None of them. If he likes you, he will say that your IQ is low. <laughs> that is for people he likes. You know what I mean? Sometimes we work very hard to prove Donald Trump right. Yeah. Or, or how else do you explain what happened on Tuesday in Nigeria's capital, Abuja? How else? Well, uh, 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 Did you know what happened? Oh, what happened? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at Abuja. <laughs> oh, Abuja is yeah. So our main story. Another Tuesday coup uh -huh. happened in Nigeria last week. Oh. It was the third coup to happen in Nigeria in the last three weeks. Uh -huh. Like the other ones, it fell too. <laughs> it fell, you know. Yeah. This is what we know as of today. The night before, rumors had it that the remnants of APC senators, you know uh -huh. the, the people uh -huh. that were left, uh -huh. were set to impeach the Senate president, oh. Bukola Saraki. You know the guy. Uh -huh. In the morning, PDP lawmakers went to the National Assembly to stop that from happening. Yeah. Now, on getting there, this is a wonderful story. They saw the building in a lockdown. Uh -huh. Manning the entrances were masked men hey. of the Department of State Security. Take a look at them. Uh -huh. hey. You know, on social media and on the streets, there were screams that our democracy was under attack. Uh -huh. Save our democracy. Save our democracy. Save our democracy. It's, 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 videos and pictures of the assault on Nigeria's democracy hit social media. Yeah. 
watch. When you begin anti-democratic uh, situations like this, including the DSS officials, I want all of you to photograph all those breaking the law. Get me their pictures, get me their names. We will submit the names of the DSS officials, the names of Senator Fabio and the gang to the embassies. I've been in touch with them already. They are waiting for <laughs> <laughs> whatever whatever made our internet senator uh -huh. to have the common sense to step out of the internet you know how to step out of the internet and onto the street was obviously something big you know he had he, and, and he wasn't alone look at this one i dare you to shoot this bullet you cannot come and go back to your station go back to your station you cannot come here and embarrass us and they also oppress us here. Uh -huh. The same people we are fighting for. That was Burma Goodhead, hey. a female lawmaker, leading what the resistance. Resistance. Goodhead. Uh -huh. I wish we have more good heads in Abuja. Our freedom. Good heads. That's her name. We have a lot of bad heads. You know. Good. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait. 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 Did, did Did you see Did you see how buffed up those DSS guys are? Did uh -huh. you see that? And and their top notch guns. Uh -huh. <laughs> I didn't know we have such guys in our security services. I didn't know. You know it's weird. Why is it then that Boko Haram and the Arakta Gami uh -huh. and the armed um, Fulani headsmen yep. that they are terrorizing Nigeria when yeah. we have these men? Why? Where have they been hiding this hard yeah, yeah, yeah. Where? 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 Are they just there for decoration? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I, I get it. I forgot. They are needed for the time to arrest judges and journalists. Yes, yeah, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it. Anyway, anyway, as the drama unfolded, uh -huh. Nigerians sent messages to the acting president, Professor Yemi Oshibajo. Yeah, yeah I know you say a friend. Ah. <laughs> you drew him, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you know Nigerians, you know, some abuse the man. Uh -huh. They accuse the man of being a fake Christian, yeah. a fake Professor of law, uh -huh. a fake senior advocate of Nigeria. Yeah. Aisha Yusuf, you know the you know the woman, uh -huh. called him a green snake in a green grass. Wow. Look at the tweet. Oh my god. The green snake under this. green grass. Do you know those rats that will eat your toes <laughs> and will fan you to keep you sleeping? <laughs> in the morning, you will wake up <laughs> with your feet that hurts. That's Professor Oshibajo for you. Oh. I said, damn, damn, damn. Damn. I, I, I fear, I fear that woman. <laughs> she finished the acting president. Ah. Or, or, or so she thinks. Nah, or so she thinks. Anyway, according to my crack reporters, uh -huh. the one tweet that actually touched the acting president mm -hmm. was the tweet from yours truly. Uh -huh. The tweet did not abuse the man. No. It just reminded him of what his wife was thinking about. On days like that Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Take a look. In the tweet, the wife said to him, You, eh? You know it is easy for a camel to go through the eye of a needle mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. than for a politician like you to enter the kingdom of God. Oh. That was it. That was it. The tweet got into the acting president's feed at 8.54 a.m. Uh -huh. And by 9 a.m., the acting president took a decision that changed the course of the day's history. So he checked his measure. Together. Acting President Professor Yemeshi Bajo Sachs, Director General of the Department of State Services of a blockade of the National Assembly, names Matthew Safer Acting DG. What? Yep. One cabal down. Two more to go. Yeah. <laughs> As we speak, there is another cabal hanging around in Asso Rock. Yeah. You know the one I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. He has no army, but he has more power. He's more dangerous than the one that they just sacked. Mm -hmm. Why are you showing that picture now? Yeah. Why are you pointing the arrow? Is that me? guy, doctor? I said one of them. Uh, How do you know it's that one? Okay, okay. So, 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 what, what really happened? Why was the arrest act? Do you know? What? Acting president condemns blockade of the National Assembly by men of the DSS, describing it as gross violation of constitutional order and the rule of law. Senate Minority Leader Gotwula Pavia resigns his position, even as he keeps mum on possible defection from the PDP to the APC. Uh, the question is this. So if the president did not send Daura to go and block the National Assembly, uh, who did? Who gave the orders? Uh, According to Sahara reporters, you know Sahara reporters, uh, no, they true. check their story again and again, again. and then they recheck it uh -huh. before they publish. Uh -huh. So, according to Sahara reporters, uh -huh. Dara was working for Saraki. What? Yeah. 
His goal was to block the National Assembly and get the public sympathy to support Saraki in his fight with the presidency. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, yeah. Here is Saraki. Hey! Yeah, yeah. Here is Saraki <laughs> the day after, thanking the acting president, of course. The former um, mayor commissioner, Do you remember, yeah. for firing Daura. Take yeah. a look. You see, while while you are scratching your your head, what's going on, doctor? While you are scratching your head on this one, just think of this. Why is it that some big decisions mm -hmm. are only taken when Buhari is out of the country? Uh. Why? Have you asked yourself that question? Could it be that the Jew in Asurok is stopping him from seeing any evil, <laughs> hearing any evil? Doing something about evil hey, around him. Is it? Could that problem. be? Maybe, 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 maybe he should just Kukuma stay in London. You know just what I mean? You. And and come in every other weekend to uh, cash his check. You know what I mean? Uh, we, we don't mind. Do you mind? Do you mind? Oh, we, don't mind. we don't mind. Yeah, once a month, come and cash your check. Now, now some newspapers are reporting that SARS are holding the sacked director of the DSS. Uh, now, I don't want to believe that. This yeah. is the past. This is, they just they just want us to start dancing on the street. You know what I mean? And to forget that we want to end SARS. We want to end. We still want to end it. You know, if truly they are holding Dara, we don't mind um, bringing him to the courts tomorrow. <laughs> you know what I mean? In handcuffs, but, uh, just coming down from Black Maria. Uh, you know, me, me so many people will be happy. The Shiites will be happy. Uh -huh. the journalists who were locked up for two years, they will be happy. Yeah. Even, if even I, you, you, you know, even you never can tell. Even <laughs> even the dear friends might just be happy. Ah! You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, one, la one last thing, one last thing before I go. <laughs> Did you hear that when the acting president uh -huh. demanded to know who gave Daura the order to send DSS men to the National Assembly, uh -huh. that the man said this, and I quote: "I don't have to answer to you. <laughs> I answer only to the president uh -huh. and the commander in chief." Who appointed me? Help! <laughs> Quote unquote. You know, in other words, you know what? Dara was just saying to the acting president uh -huh. that as far as we, the cabal, are concerned, you are still a mayor commissioner. Now, 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 we will always remember Dara as the first man from Castina <laughs> to be fired by a mayor commissioner. Anyway, Reno or Mockery, you know Reno or Mockery, uh -huh. said that Dara was crying like a baby. Hey. When he was arrested, I'm like, hey, yeah, life is a mystery. How did my daughter say, life is a mystery? Everyone must stand alone. I hear you call my name, and it feels like home. Anyway, by the time you watch this episode, it will have been close to 40 days and 40 nights. Since Premium Times newspaper, you know the paper, oh my God. accused <laughs> Nigeria's Minister for Finance ah! of submitting a fake NYC exam certificate. <laughs> 40 days and 40 nights. <laughs> if Jesus was in the wilderness for 40 days, uh -huh. Kemi Adosun, Antigemi, uh -huh. has been in her own wilderness uh -huh. of silence <laughs> for a full amount of time. <laughs> now, now, this British trained woman still thinks that Nigerians demanding answers are beneath her. They're going to be, wow. guys are beneath me. Mm -hmm. One of the options available yeah, to her yeah, is to sue them online. Sue the online newspaper. That's the option. It's an option. That could be a reaction. Yeah, sure. But she won't take that option. Now, just as a reminder of where she came from, here is Kemi Adelson at her confirmation hearing. Take it. Just last week, I was renominated to serve as the Commissioner for Finance in Ogun State. And for me, that was a great honor, having been the first woman to have occupied that position. To then find myself nominated by His Excellency the President as a ministerial candidate is an unbelievable honor and privilege. Uh, <laughs> you, know, you, know, you, know, you know, if she had stayed as Commissioner for Finance in uh, Ogun State, none of this would have happened. You know? But she wanted the unbelievable honor and privilege of being Nigeria's Minister for Finance. Yep. Unfortunately, that honor and privilege entails having to be held accountable yep. for her actions. Assurance. Now, 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 at her screening, no senator questioned the authenticity of her NYC exam certificate. Mm -hmm. but, but, but she kind of hinted at, at, um, at it when she talked about her approach 
to solving problems. Problems like not having <laughs> NYSC exams. <laughs> Take a look. What I believe is that we need innovative, creative solutions. <laughs> what? What? Oluwole is an innovative solution to not having NYSC certificate. Is it not? Is it? 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 Is and I'm very sure it's something that is very high on the list of, of, of um, initiatives. <laughs> see, 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 where Kemi, Kemi, Auntie Kemi was uh -huh. educated, this kind of thing cannot happen. No. In fact, where Kemi was educated, a government minister was led to take questions from members of the House of Commons. Mm -hmm. House of Commons, so not House of Lords. No, House, House of, of Commons. 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 Guess, Commons. yeah, the commoners. Guess what he did? Guess, guess what he did? What, no. He he offered to raise. You know, you know what? During the five years of which it's been my privilege to answer questions from this dispatcher box on behalf of the government, I've always believed that we should offer rise to the highest possible standards of courtesy and respect in responding on behalf of the government to the legitimate questions of the legislature. I'm thoroughly ashamed at not being in my place and therefore I shall be offering my resignation to the Prime Minister. <laughs> <laughs> so this week, Nigeria's Minister for Information explained to us for the first time why Buhari has not taken action on anti um certificate forgery. Why? Why? According to Lai Mohammed, you know you can trust uh -huh. him. The allegation is still being investigated. Wow! I know, I know. Please don't hold your breath, you know. <laughs> they are still investigating Baba Che Alawa, <laughs> Ayo Oke, and uh, Abdul Salami Maina, and many others. They are still investigating. The world will figure out who killed JFK yeah. before they know whether anti Kemi's certificate was fake or, uh -huh. or real. It should take that long. So don't hold your breath. Now, now, for the avoidance of doubt, Lai Mohammed made it clear that none of that had any impact on Buhari's integrity. Wow. None. He said, he said that I quote, Buhari's credibility remains intact eh? despite the allegation. <laughs> you see, the man Lai Mohammed, he plays too much. Shall we tell, the, shall we tell the president? No, I, shall we? Wait, wait, okay. <laughs> shall we tell the president these people are playing with him? Doctor, long distance, long distance. <laughs> you know, I consider telling Buhari the truth. Anyway, before we go, let me update you quickly on some African stories that we have been following. My main man in Zimbabwe, Nelson Chamisa, Chamisa! the leader of the main opposition party, uh -huh. is still sitting in limbo. Uh -huh. He's in limbo. Take a look. We are not accepting fake results. We are not accepting this fiction. We want a proper result to be announced. We will pursue all means necessary. Ah. <laughs> the man, the man, the man, Chamisa is still insisting that he won an election that the Zimbabwean electoral body said President uh, MSN uh, Manangwaya eh? won by 50.8%. Wow! Poor Chamisa, you know, he had a press conference. <laughs> yeah, he had a press conference where he announced that he is the true president of Zimbabwe uh, uh, and that he that. has evidence of election rigging. Take a look. This election, as a presidential result, is fraudulent, illegal, illegitimate, and characterized by serious credibility gaps and some serious legitimacy issues that we feel must be raised. We must place it on record without equivocation that we won this election. And that because we won this election, we are already ready to form the next government. Ah! I know, I know. Now, now, wow. for avoidance of doubt, Chamisa announced that he would not attend Menengwaya's inauguration on Sunday. Wow. And I'm like, hey, yeah, yeah. And they have reserved a seat, a seat for him. What are, what are they going to do now? Eh? Eh? Like what, are, what are they going to do? You know? Now, Nelson Chamisa said that I like the man. Why are you laughing? I like the man. <laughs> Nelson Chamisa said that it is Emerson Menengagwa, uh -huh. the man he called um, outgoing president, uh -huh. that should attend his own Thank inauguration. You. you know? Now, now you have to be sorry for the young man. You know, yeah. African politics is not a joke. It's not a joke. It's not a joke. It's not a joke. It follows no known pattern. Yeah. Does anybody remember Raila Odinga? Uh -huh. Of Kenya. Do you remember him? Yeah. <laughs> the people's president. Uh -huh. 
Maisha ni ngumu. When it comes to Africa, maisha ni ngumu. Maisha ni ngumu. If Zimbabwe ended up this way, imagine what will happen in Cameroon in October. Yeah. We don't even know any opposition leader who is challenging Paul Bia. We don't know. We don't even know if Paul Bia will bother to campaign. Or debate. He may even, no, no, he, there's no debate now. He may decide to stay in Switzerland and mail his vote in to Cameroon. You know? Oh my God. What we know is that the killings of people from the English speaking part of Cameroon continues. Uh -huh. Man, we we'll call secrets of pictures it's based on the premise that the picture is worth more than a thousand. Wow, no, 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 the picture you're looking at is that of um, the Senate uh, deputies uh, president, uh -huh. Senator Ike Equeremado. You know him, not not the Equeremado, uh -huh. Ike Equeremado. Ike Equeremado. That recently, listen, the, the, the EFCC invited him uh -huh. to account for how he acquired uh -huh. 22 houses uh -huh. all across Nigeria. Oh, During the questioning, he fell ill, <laughs> <laughs> which is normal now, you know. <laughs> so, so the FC said, you know what, you know what, go home and take care of yourself. When you uh -huh. come back, we will now continue yeah. our conversation. Uh -huh. So go, guess what? He went uh -huh. home and then he went and brought the top apostles, uh -huh. prophets, uh -huh. pastors, uh -huh. evangelists, uh -huh. all over Enugu to come to his house and uh -huh. pray for him. That is the picture you're looking at. They are uh -huh. praying for him. Now, now, what you don't see there is that there are 22 apostles and pastors uh -huh. and prophets. Each one is assigned a house uh -huh. to pray for a house for the safe return of one of Equeremado's house. <laughs> I'm, I'm why are you laughing now? This is the secret of the picture. You guys just see pictures. You don't know what's behind it. I'm explaining the inside of, you know, stuff, you know. Anyway, uh -huh. so you are assigned to one house. I mean, because we need to test your power, yeah. you know. There's no need to be doing general yeah. prayer. Yeah. If your house is not returned safely, you are, you are, your ministry is bad. <laughs> Why? Why? Oh, who did this to us? Why can't one one pastor be enough? Why do you need to need two pastors to pray for you? Eh? Did they all collect envelope at the end of the day? <laughs> That's for you. That's for you. You are eminent number five. You are Babuja House number seven. If it doesn't come back, I need the money back. <laughs> APC senators received one million dollars each uh -huh. to impeach Saraki, <laughs> says Senator Ibrahim. <laughs> this is this day. I didn't. I didn't write this. This uh -huh. day, newspaper. This day. Now my question is, where could they have gotten that kind of money? You know? In, never mind. Never mind. Uh -huh. Never mind. Thank you, Sunny Abacha. Thank you. You know. You know. Abacha saved money. Put the money he saved for us. We are putting it to good use. Uh -huh. <laughs> Whenever, but no, whenever you remember your ancestors, this is one of the smartest ones, you know, uh, but oh. a smart ancestor. Oh. If it's an Igbo, if, 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 if man had been an Igbo man, if you throw the cola nuts, you just you call him, Sunny, Sunny Abacha, this is for you, for, for putting money away for us for bad days. Sunny, this is for you. <laughs> Nonsense. <laughs> Smart ancestors, or oh, not? Not everybody. Ha you, do you have a smart ancestor? <laughs> no, nobody. Nothing. You are here you're hanging around in New York. Nothing. <laughs> These tall buildings you are looking at, there are some ancestors that built it for their children and their grandchildren. Your, 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 your own is doing <laughs> just drinking pan wine. Anyway, next, we are hungry, not getting enough from the center, says the Emmy of Daura. Oh, I'm like, yeah, hey, yeah you know. Yeah. You know, good luck telling this Baba about resource control. <laughs> He's complaining about not getting enough. Good, good luck calling him for national conference and yeah. telling him, look, we have to control our resources. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? He, he's not their son that is in uh, Abuja. Yeah. Daura and uh, Buhari yeah, yeah, and yeah. other Daura and, and the other. Daura. Yeah. <laughs> ah, anyway. Obasanjo swears he will never support Atiku yeah. for president. <laughs> Uh, you, see, you see, 20 years from now, the only thing history will remember between these two guys, uh -huh. Obasanjo and Atiku, yeah. is that Obasanjo knelt down for Atiku oh. to beg him for a second time. That's all that history will remember. It doesn't uh -huh. matter what Obasanjo is saying. You knelt down for Atiku. Yeah. <laughs> it pains him. That's why we're saying it. It makes him mad. Anyway, next. Oh, oh this is good. Boko Haram, army chief. Burata, you know him? Yeah, Burata. Spits fire. Yeah. Once his commanders uh -huh. against fleeing from terrorists. Yeah. <laughs> now, this headline makes me uh, feel like 
Is it not the, the long defeated Boko Haram that they were talking about? Is it over? Yeah? Fighters who. You are lying! <laughs> what? We celebrated their defeat. What happened? No! What do you call the head of an army? Yeah? Mm. Where the commanders are fleeing from terrorists? What do you call the head of that army? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> This guy cannot think of his feet. <laughs> Comedy is hard, you know what I mean? <laughs> Satire is hard. He's just here, you know. It's a <laughs> He's hard. It's a <laughs> what, did, what did she say? It's a goat. <laughs> What's a goat? Him, no. Okay, him. <laughs> okay. I just want to make sure because <laughs> I'll give him the email address. <laughs> no, not Dr. Damages. Anyway, this one is for you. I always get one for you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, kidnapper under the influence of tramadol <laughs> doses off oh. in victims' compound. Oh my god, he already ah. kidnapped the guy, ah. but because he took so much, he dozed off. <laughs> <laughs> you see, you see, a country where the criminals what? are not serious uh -huh. about their business, okay, will never survive. Yeah. Lie, 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 lie. No hope, there's no hope for that country. Mm. I mean, the politicians can mess up, but the criminals, once they begin to be unserious yeah. yeah. about their. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's no hope for that country. I'm telling you. The reason why America works is that the criminals in America are serious about their business. Uh -huh. They set the pace. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. You design a computer program, they come with a bug and be able, you know, they have to be up top notch. Uh -huh. You're criminals. Educated criminals. Our positions failed. Our criminals are failing us. Too. <laughs> it's a hopeless situation. <laughs> So what happened to the hostage? <laughs> Nonsense. Everything is it's a mess. Huh? Jaga, jaga. Africa, jaga, jaga. Nigeria, jaga, jaga. jaga. You know, that's, that's what we're Everything is scatter, scatter. So what happened to the hostage when the robbers <laughs> they, 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 they came out and took a picture <laughs> of the kidnappers. That's what they did. They took a picture of the kidnappers and they are showing us on, online. Ah. These are the people that kidnapped us. <laughs> he had his gun and you look at the picture. Look at it. Nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for you, huh? It's time for you, huh? Email! Wow! Did you know it's finally a unicorn? Your money, that money! My money! Is, look, 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 look at the diamond! You see, hey. you see, the problem with spending money is if you're spending money, you don't see it. Ah. But if you're spending it and you are seeing the money, you know what I mean? You, you, you feel it. <laughs> <laughs> when, the, when they withdraw the money, the accounts will do. <sighs> That's how it goes. Mm. It deflected. Deflected. Mm. Mm. I can now I'm seeing it. You'll be happy. Uh, and and this friend. looks like Give a British. Smile, you don't see this guy in America. Give us some smile. You see what I'm saying? Now you're talking. <laughs> So you're talking. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so for the men who've been writing, she's she's back. Uh, ah, she's back. She's back. Anyway, anyway. Do you, do you have emails? Do we have emails? Today? Every day, doctor. Okay, let's hear them, please. Okay, our first email is from Chinedu. Oh, Chinedu. Hey, yeah, Chinedu. Hey, hey, you. Uh -huh. hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. He knows the language. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, what does he want? And he writes. Yes. Dr. Damages. Yes, man. Good work. Yeah, you see, I told you, man. I have been watching your program weekly since February 2018. Oh, wow, I told you. I have a question. Okay. Mm -hmm. Please, what's happening with Road to Me, Chibike, Amechi? Ah! All his government All his government names. His government names. <laughs> <laughs> All of them. He knows him very well. Mm. I've not heard from him. Hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. I wonder what happened if PEP should win the election. PEP. Ah, there's no chance for PEP. I ah, you know the no guy. Yeah, no, no way. No way. We can't. 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 Uh, Chichina, do thank you for your email. Wait, wait, wait. about Amechi, let me clear that one first. Amechi is very busy. That's why you don't hear from him. Mm. He's busy building railways all across Nigeria. Uh -huh. He lets his works and his stomach talk for him. <laughs> <laughs> have, you, have you seen him in the recent list? Yes, no. His stomach <laughs> is, 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 <laughs> is, is in front. Okay. Now, now, are you saying you don't like agege bread? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's the most popular bread all over Africa. Africa yes. I went to Kenya. It was there. Yeah. Even in Brooklyn here. If you go to the African store, agege, agege bread. bread. They write it. I, have you tried to eat it with beans? You know, mm -hmm. put beans inside. Yeah. Or aka, I got, inside. I got beans. Uh, you know, you have to try it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. We now, need to think about that. We need to think about another name. All right. I mean, guys, write me. Tell me what you think. It should be her name. She's. And when she's, we when we finalize on the name, we'll discuss financial. <laughs> It's always about it's money. Like, it's always it's about money. Yeah. It's never enough. You know, <laughs> give them one diamond, they want two. Yes. Huh? 
<laughs> All right, next. Our second email is from Dio Adebari from UK. Oh, Dio. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm good friends with yeah, UK. Yeah, yeah. When we were there, you know, yeah, sister. Know. Uh-huh. And he writes. Mm-hmm. Hello, Dr. Damages. Yes. This is Dial from the UK. We know. We know. <laughs> I'm a big fan of your show. You see? And I was wondering if your show, if you, your show can be on YouTube at least twice a week. Wow. Twice a week. Mm-hmm. Also, can you make sure the noisemaker is louder in the next show? <laughs> As it wasn't loud. Hey! Oh my God! Thank you! 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 I wish you know <laughs> about us coming twice a week. Uh-huh. This is an inside joke. Anyway, anyway. <laughs> we, initially, we designed this for five days a week. <laughs> but uh, it's still on the design side. <laughs> <laughs> one, is, one, one is hard for us. One is hard for us. And they are talking about five. <laughs> anyway, anyway, as for the noise maker, as for the noise maker I forgot to buy him puff puff <laughs> for the last few weeks. So today, I got puff puff. <laughs> Came like this. Yes. So maybe they put in some uh, you go inside. <laughs> you know these Jamaicans. I don't know. <laughs> they put in some you go, you go inside. It's a sign of poster. It's a sign of poster. Is it? Not against money. Uh, without, I will increase the puff Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Next, our last email is from Aisha. Ah, Aisha. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Aisha, my Aisha. Is that Aisha, my Aisha? Hey. You don't, you, I know you. I have a huge Aisha. Wait, wait, wait. If you get an email from Aisha, be careful. Because uh, it's from Aisha, my Aisha. Aisha, oh. Aisha. Yeah, don't, don't, yes, don't. Oh, it's Aisha, my Aisha. Yeah, this, this is, is Aisha for you. This is spe- no, 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 no. This is special email. Read it. Let me hear it. Okay. Let play, me, play good let music. Me, hey, let me, Sasha, hey, Sasha. Hey. Why you play nice music so that the uh, environment will be calm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You no, know, this is from Aisha. Aisha. Okay, okay. okay. No, it's a long time. It's a long time. Yeah, yeah. Aisha, my yeah, Aisha. Aisha. Yes. My, uh, not you, Aisha. My Aisha. Aisha, your Aisha. Ah, now oh. you're talking. Yeah. Aisha, your Aisha. Yes, yes. Okay. Now you are. And she writes, mm. longest time, the kids are damaged. You see what I'm talking about? You see, Aisha, Aisha. Ah, yeah, I'm not kidding. You know? Please, I'd like to submit my CV to you. Ah. Sasha always makes you scream and she doesn't even tweet when you tell her to. Uh, it's true. I, she doesn't tweet. When I would I say love it. to take her position and leave this Nigeria bag. What? Aisha is coming to America. <laughs> this is a movie. You Aisha. know, the, the story will change. My life will change. You know what I mean? Yeah, even change. my ministry will change. <laughs> Ah, she's she's like, and she writes again, no. Okay. Please can not see the noise maker. Continue to read the emails. Oh, okay. uh, uh, wait, wait, wait. Aisha has not watched this show for a long time. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> and she's like, give tomato just real maternity leave. Uh, yeah. What? Aisha, Aisha, Aisha didn't know that tomato is uh, is gone to just. <laughs> what? 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 I, Aisha, Aisha, thank it's you, thank you. To just okay, okay. thank you, Aisha, my Aisha. You know, Sasha, did you hear that? Aisha wants your job. Mm. I'm glad people like Aisha are noticing that some of the people we have here are, are not um, living up to the expectation. I don't want to call names. Uh-huh. <laughs> as for as for Tomato Joss, uh-huh. we have a due date. Hey! <laughs> hey! We have a due date. Hey, we have a due date. Finally! We have a due date. Hey! Tomato Joss! And we are going Finally! to show you the pictures when, when it happens. Yes! <laughs> That's all the time we have for emails. Please keep sending your emails to Dr. Damages at gmail.com. And follow us on Twitter at Dr. Damages. And on Instagram at Dr. Damages. Now, here is my concern for today. Uh-huh. It's taken from page 419 uh-huh. of the book, The Power of Positive Thinking. Hey, Power of Positive. That sounds By Norman Vincent Pell. Hey. And it says, it. That's it. Empty pockets uh-huh. never held anyone back. Huh. Only empty heads and empty hats can do that. Mm, that is very, very deep. It doesn't matter very if you have one. If you have empty hat mm-hmm. and empty head, uh-huh. that's what will hold you down. Mm-hmm. Yes. If you have the passion, you find a way. Yes, mm. that's correct. Until next week, I'm Dr. Damages. I diagnose you. You hear yourself. Woo! Woo! Nice. Again, get get bread. Bread. Hey, this earring is yeah, wonderful. Yeah, you like amazing. This uniform now, so amazing. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. assurance. Uh, yeah. You, assurance. Can, you, can, hey. you can retire on this one. Assurance. Assurance. Can you play? Hey. Yeah, let, let her dance for them. You know, they are. Hey, Sasha. Hey, Sasha is sleeping. <laughs> Sasha is sleeping again. What did we do here? <laughs>